Morgan. I work in the front office at Rowlett Middle as the attendance clerk. I just wanna go over a few important items regarding attendance for your student. It's vital for your child's success that they're on time and present and ready to learn each day, regardless of their modality of instruction. When your child needs to be absent for the day, whether they're face-to-face, -face, hybrid, or they're learning through e-learning, please call Rowlett and press eight for the attendance line voicemail. That is where you will leave your message. Please leave your name, your relationship to the student and your student's name, and the reason for their absence. If you know in advance that your student's going to be absent for an extended period of time, please let the office know and their teachers as well so that they can plan for any work that they would need to make up. If your student has a doctor's note, please have them give it to their ILE teacher so we can excuse that absence for them. If you need to schedule a parent-teacher conference, we'll be utilizing the Zoom application. We ask you to please call the front office. A day will be selected that's most convenient for you and your child's teachers. As always, you can find this and all other pertinent information in your child's agenda or by logging on to rowlettmiddleacademy.org. Hi families, I'm Miss Beth and I'm gonna be at the front desk. To ensure the safety of everyone and to limit the amount of people in the office, we're asking that you try to make doctor's appointments on days and times that you'll be off campus. If there's an emergency and you need to pick your child up early from school, it has to be done by 2.30. We're asking that you please call the office when you arrive in the parking lot and we'll send for your student to come to the office. You can sign your child out at the log book located outside the office door. If your driver's license is not in our system, you'll have to come in the office and scan it. We're asking that only one adult is in the office at a time and that everyone that enters the office must be wearing a mask. If you're bringing your student to school late, please have your student enter the office while you wait in the car. We will take your child's temperature and give you a thumbs up when you know it's okay to leave. We look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you. Hello, RMA families. My name is Maria Hasek and I'm the school registrar. I just wanna emphasize how important it is to keep us updated with any changes in your student's personal information. If you have any changes in your address, phone number, or email, the enrolling parent would need to fill out a student information change form with a copy of the driver's license and proof of new address. For example, a copy of an electric bill, water bill, or mortgage statement if your address has changed. That is all I have for now. Have a wonderful school year. Bye. Welcome to Rowlett Middle Academy. My name is Kelly Petrosino. I'm the bookkeeper here. I've been here since we started RMA and I'm excited to be starting year number four. Just a couple bookkeeping tips. If you are sending a payment to school with your child, I ask that you please put your child's name in the memo section of your check. If it's cash, please attach a note. It's very helpful for me to apply payment if I know who the student is and what it's for. If you also include your student's iLead teacher, that's also helpful and appreciated. Something new we have this year, if you go to our school website, on the very end tab, it says shop. You will be able to go in there. You create an account that you will use all year. You have to create the account in order to put something in the cart. Once you have in the cart, you t it also links it to your student so I know who the payment is for. It will also list anything that we have that's going on as far as a sale. It could be a donation, it can be your iPad fee, it could be t-shirts, um, band, band fees. That is something new for us. It is a contactless payment and it is um, for credit card payments. If you choose not to use that, we just ask that you send check or money, cash, with your student to school. That is all I have for you, and I hope we all have a great year. Thank you.